Hello, Anthony here, and welcome to another installment to our Framing Tech 101 video series. Today, we'd like to talk about pivot joints and how to incorporate them into your projects. Pivot joints are a robust connector that can be used statically or dynamically. They can be incorporated into your design as angled braces, and they can also be used to attach angled wall sections together, which would otherwise be attached with connection plates. Pivot joints are also commonly used with adjustable arms and legs. All of our pivot joints come in two different styles, with a lock handle and without. The handles are helpful in order to quickly loosen and tighten the pivot joint in order to set it at a specific angle. Simply loosen the handle, set your angle, and tighten it back into position. We have end-to-end -end hardware, end-to-T-slot hardware, and T-slot-to-T-slot hardware. When ordering, please specify which hardware you need for your design. In order to mount a pivot joint to the end of a piece of extrusion, the extrusion must be tapped to receive the appropriate screw. Here, we have an M12 tap to receive an M12 screw. Simply align your pivot joint and tighten it until it's secure. To mount the pivot joint to a T-slot, we like to first preload the necessary T-slot hardware for the application. Then, locate your pivot joint into position and tighten the screws to secure it. In addition, all of our pivot joints come with either an alignment tab or an alignment insert. This feature assists with preventing rotation or twisting in T-slot so that the pivot joint can maintain its position. As always, we hope that you found this video to be informative. Please reach out to us in the comments section with any questions and subscribe to us to see more content like this. Thanks for watching and let Framing Tech help turn your ideas into reality today.